How does a $200,000 plastic tube bankrupt a $10 million armored unit? It's not just firepower, it's the wallet. A main battle tank is a money pit, costing millions to build and thousands per hour just to keep the engine running. The javelin? It sits in a box, eats nothing, and costs zero dollars until the trigger is pulled. Why is this trade-off so brutal? Consider the deterrence multiplier. For every dollar spent on a missile, the enemy must spend $10 on active protection systems, cope cages, and extra support just to survive. This forces opponents to divert strategic funds from attacking to merely trying not to explode. Here is the hardcore logic, Lanchester's square law. In the past, war was a numbers game. Whoever had more guns usually won, but precision guidance hacks this rule. When accuracy hits 94%, a single soldier effectively possesses the mathematical stopping power of an entire tank platoon. The tank isn't fighting a soldier, it is fighting a probability equation it cannot beat. This is the new economic reality of warfare. Heavy armor becomes a liability when cheap, smart munitions dominate the field. The javelin doesn't just destroy the hull, it destroys the budget. 